First time we ever had poop in our driveway. <laughs> Good morning guys, welcome to today's video. I needed to write down on everybody's bucket what they get so we're all on the same page. Look at this, my riding boots, my helmet. I'm dying to get back on that horse. But the problem is this, I got horseback riding thighs. Same. <laughs> I was going down the hill today and the mud started attaching to my boots and it was propelling me down the hill and I was like, Oh no, because I didn't have any muscles anywhere to stop myself. So I just started flying down the hill and I'm like, help me! <laughs> but yeah, I, I saved myself. He's in pajamas. Yeah, I got my pajamas, I got my bed head. I am dressed. Yeah, I'll be stressed, but what's gonna happen when we get back to the house? I'm gonna have a shower. Yeah, and what are you doing? I did not brush dressed. my hair yet. That is so dirty. How did that get dirty already? Is it clean? Yes, it was in my closet. Oh. Yeah, and uh, this girl's gonna do laundry. Like, it's been a whirlwind of a week, you guys. A whirlwind, but so much fun. His, his no, water mud, bucket was mud. on the ground. So, Finn, you guys, who was expecting that yesterday? We drove him into a brand new environment. He doesn't even hardly know us. Sophia walked him around that arena like a boss. Sophia, when you walked him around that arena and explained to him through your body language that there was no reason to be scared, do you think that made a big he difference? Just the arena. Yeah. And you know what was really sad? I put this in the video yesterday, but then had to take it out. I said to Fiona, Sophie got on that horse, and no matter what was happening, she was going to make it the best ride of her life because there's no way somebody is taking away her pony, right? No way. Except yeah. when she's older and when she has Like, to literally, she loves Stella so much. And then we were like, you can't ride her anymore. She's, she's not your horse anymore. And it was heartbreaking, right? And at least we still have her. Yeah, we still have her. We still love her. And, and you are going to ride her again. Yeah. yeah. It's not that she's not going to get to ride her again. When she is. she's more like trained. Yeah, yeah. So anyway, Sophie's not gonna let anything happen. She's staking claim to this boy, and there's nothing that's gonna keep her away. Like, I think it takes that. Lose. Sometimes it takes losing the love of your life to realize how much you need to. Guys, um, when he started going fast, I take my legs completely off. Yeah, and he kept going. Uh huh. Yeah, he and was. He's, he's like, a oh, miracle just pony. Along, like it yeah. So we learned a lot yesterday. We had um, Danny the horse girl and versatile horsemanship here before they went home. They are gone home now. Um, I show, shared a little bit in yesterday's video. Some of you guys thought that Brandy was bossy. Uh, she really wasn't. I cut out all the nice parts just to make the video go faster because there was so much footage. <laughs> so no, she was not bossy. She was not mean. She was really kind and she taught us a lot and there are some really fun videos coming up about other things that she taught us, things that you guys will be happy about. Okay, having three horses at home has really killed our hay supply. <laughs> it is going down fast. Anyway, um, hay is the hardest part of feeding our horses because- Because um, mom changes it up every single time yeah, we feed it's, them. Yeah, it's, I, I just changed it. So yesterday uh, our trainer looked at Finn and said, okay, he needs more hay in his stall at night because the girls aren't letting him eat as much. We did accommodate we do put hay out in the daytime just for him though, yeah. in the arena so that he does get to eat. But, and we upped his grain. Did you give him 1.5, did you give him? One and a half, one, one and, and a half. half. Good, yeah, girls are smart. I heard, I heard that when you were talking to Viona. I'm like, okay. Okay, half, so it's half. hard for me to figure out like, cause I have to half their daily portion. So we, I give them six flakes in the morning and six flakes in the afternoon. And then they all get their own at night. All right, let's do it. I'm riding Stella today on the trail. Yeah, we're hoping after we get all like freshened up and stuff that we'll be able to take the horses for a walk. Yeah, and totally forget that it's school. Isn't it crazy how that pain in your legs where you can hardly walk, you can't sit down, feels like the best feeling ever. I'm in love with that feeling. When I fell, my biggest fear, the thing that bothered me the most was losing my muscles in my thighs because I knew how much it was gonna hurt building them back up again.
I oh, don't know what happened there. She is not drugged. So uh, basically, uh, oh, there she goes. Oh. No. <laughs> it smells like, oh my god. Was it a bird? Like, what the heck? I think they're just spicy. Yeah, they are spicy today. You know, man. That's why we're going on a walk. Yeah. Dead one day. Spicy than that. Yeah. He's not riding Finn today because he just had a long workout yesterday and every day long walks Whoa. and I'm not lots of trotting. Long trot, long. trot, 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 trot. I'll, I'll lead line you. After that ride yesterday with Sophie, he was pouring sweat. <laughs> I am dying to see what it looks like outside here. Sam will probably kill me. Door. Oh, wow. <laughs> So this is, I guess, where the water is. Uh-oh, you better get away from me. Oh, they're all like, I'm going out there. There's no, oh my gosh. What the heck, I opened the door and they all came running. They're like, I'm getting free. Back it up, sister. And she's like, holy cow. You're not going out. Don't even think you can push past me. Go away. It's nice out here, nice breeze. Oh my God, Stella. I'm a little afraid. Oh, oh, oh my gosh. Help! <laughs> Back it up. When I said door, I didn't mean... <laughs> yeah, they're a little spicy. <laughs> Holy crap. Watch, watch that bucket. I'm worried they're going to die. That All right, listen. Poo. What are you, you doing? Me. I do not know what happened down here last night, but they they are united oh. in <laughs> you know, I like jump off and jump. Stella needs to get that blanket off today. Mom, I why is that going? Roll roll and go bucket. Oh. Grab that bucket, grab that bucket and take off her blanket. Stella? Yeah. Oh my god, girls are so weird. I know. He's like Oh, oh, it's happening. You know what she's thinking? Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> this nasty pants. This nasty pants. Sin moves nice, though. Uh-huh. Never the open table. this door, you guys. Like, I'm still stuck in the door. I open the door and they're like, I'm getting free. Holy crap. Whew. That was, that was wild. Um, so yeah, this is this over here. I'm going to show you. I don't know why I did it. But, um. Let me open the door more. No. no. That was very fun. So. Basically, this is where they had to rip up to put the water line in. See there, that's the water line, I think, that little black hose. So eventually, oh, 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 no. oh, don't scare them off. They cannot eat the hay. They cannot eat fences. They have to learn to be, to figure it out. <laughs> All right, so basically, you can tell this is pretty deep. This is a lot bigger than the side where the horses are. Eventually, this is gonna be Stella and Willow's uh, summer pasture because there won't be any grass in here it'll all be sand and it'll probably go all the way down there or look right there Anyways, before I forget that what I was saying, um, down there behind the barn, we might put the boys' paddock. So the girls will be this big, huge, long one, and then the boys might be that whole back wide one for summer. Um, or else the boys are probably gonna go on that hill. I haven't decided yet, but that's probably what's gonna happen.
around the property. Finding good stuff. Oh, I love it. That's an out. Let's flip it. Yeah, I'll have to bring the trash down and get it. No, let's just try it together. So, uh, yeah, there's like so much amazing treasures in this property that we're going to be able to go and find. That's cool. So, he's going to have to get the tractor. It's still frozen, but it's an outdoor mounting block. Well, I don't see how it is. It is. Step. It's a step. But you could use it as a outdoor mounting block. I like it. What else did you find for us? Wow. Like we have a lot of cleaning up to do before this can be a paddock. And that's okay. Because we are the work family. Oops, he found a roll of fencing. Like that. Yeah. Not ideal, but it is the safer option for horses compared to what else we could have. But so there's a whole bunch of fencing there. Okay, so this is the other thing that he found that he thought would be super beneficial. There's a hay thing! Are you going to have to take the tree down? No, because it's unhooked there. It just needs to, uh, so who knows what this thing is? Maybe I have to cut the tree. I don't know. Do you guys see it? The tree is dead anyway. It is to level our arena. So Sam's going to work on getting that thing out of there and we're going to be able to use that. Wow, guys, we've never, I've never walked back here before. Uh, Sam's also going to rig up that door that I opened this morning that, that I got attacked over and um, put like a thing across it so we can leave it open. That's maybe what he can do while we're on our trail. We got that fencing wood there we could use. So we have the, all these poles, lots of these poles that we're going to utilize maybe to make our fence for our outdoor. Obviously we have like a lot of cleaning of the yard to do before we even like, that's our first priority. So yeah, this is good, nice fencing for horses. I like this stuff. I don't know if the guy's taking this out with him though. It's all on a trailer, but I mean we could use this. So yeah, this might be the back fence, the back paddock for uh, Storm and Finn. Or we'll use the hill. Well, I don't have the camera on, but that was a buck. Try again. I want to get it. Yeah, we'll, yeah. we'll walk him the first time. <laughs> Somebody's got some energy. Good boy. You should be standing on the side of him to put that halter on, not in front of him. It's hard when he's turning his head away. I know, it's really hard, but uh, people keep telling me that, and it, especially with him acting crazy like that. Good boy. Good boy. Come yeah. On. Give your horse to Gabby if you want yeah. him to be fit. So basically, he did a little running bucking fit when he saw the halter. And Gabby said, he doesn't get to run away from you. You make, you make him run. Yeah, I don't know if that's the right thing, but it sure worked. Well, if he's going to run anyway, if you better make him. You I'm get sure. to say run, run, not him. If he wants to Look run, at Stella. Look at Stella. She's like, I don't know she, what's happening there, but I don't care. She forward a bit because I was swinging the lead rope right behind her, which is fine. Yeah, she's doing so good. Thanks to the lessons that we got yesterday from Brandy from Versatile Horsemanship when she was here in Canada visiting, um, we have things that we can work on now when we go for a walk. Instead of us pulling our horses, we, we now know how to lead them properly and it's going to be a, a lot of, it's going to be like a really fun training ride for us. Training for us, not for them. Gabby, this pony has turned into a dream, huh? She absolutely is. She loves small She does. And even if she will, she will only get two strides down the wall and then boom. I have to drag them. All right. See, Mom? I yeah. have to drag them. She's not used to it, Gets everything really fast. Very nice. For any of you guys who have been watching us through our journey, you'll know that we pulled our horses along a lot because every time we sped up, they didn't. And yeah. And it might not be perfect yet, but we're really working on 
That that rope's a bit tight though. I tied two knots so it can't go. Oh, she tied two knots so it can't go tighter. Good job, Gabby. And then there's Willow. She's like, leave me out of it. <laughs> She's like, suckers. Yo, Willow. <laughs> nice job. Nice boy. And there's Willow. She's like, if you do anything wrong, Finn, I will get you. And Hendrix is up above. No. Where are you, Kitty? You go see him. <laughs> He's like, I want to do it too. Got to get a, a halter for little Hendrix there. Finn, Finn likes kitties. You like Hendrix? Hendrix loves horses, you guys. Uh-oh. He thinks he's food. Are you hungry, Finn? So Gabby's working on some stuff that she learned with Willow, and Stella's just watching. She's That's just... the exact same spot that I left her. When yeah, I Gabby left her in this spot, and now she's just standing here. She's just, she's just watching them work, and she's just so chill. I'm in love with this girl, even more than ever before. Okay, that's, that's nice, thanks. She doesn't like the camera. Um, uh, there's gotta come a time now when this girl and I connect. When we reconnect and become friends and I take over a lot of her like grooming and stuff like that because right now I just let the girls do it because it's easier for me and more natural for me. But she's like, no, <laughs> she's back in way. But we got to do it, Stella, you and I. Let me clean your eye. Oops, hold on. There we go. We got to be friends. It's got to be you and me because we're going away soon and we're going to all be together and you're going to be with me. It's glorious out here. I'm ready to take off my coat. It's the warmest day we've had yet. This is this is summer. Like one thing you guys don't know is that in Ontario where I live, it goes from winter usually, boom, it's hot. And it's about to be like that. Right. Oh, look at this horse doesn't even move. Yeah, you're holding her too. Which... No, but I mean she didn't. And even though it's not great to mount from a little tiny block, it's really been it's, fine. it's really been handy. Everyone's ready except for me. All right, go get ready. I got Willow. So if he's gonna walk, Finn, because he's a little bit of a, of a. Wait a minute, how are you getting out? No, I'm gonna dismount and. Oh, okay. So I'm you're just, just taking her for a little walk around the arena first. I'm figuring her out first. Okay. Finn. Daddy. Yeah. Ch -ch 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 while you're on a wild pony is not the best. Yeah, Stella's good. How will I feel it if you believe in me? How will you let me in if you are ready? How do I reach you? I'm thinking about us. You're thinking about it too. Yeah, this this is my dream girl. Wow. Look at that. Higher and higher. I'm gonna raise the flag. Fire will fire. Send out a flare to find. Give me a reason. I'm gonna send a sign. Calling you over. Calling you to my life. I could win shows on her. You could win shows on her. I could, I'm winning shows on her. You're gonna win all the shows? She's like, this is so good. Yeah. Find behind the line. If you believe in love, give me a feeling. If you believe in me, hold me and let me in. If you are ready, I'm gone. There's a scary bug on flying around Gabby. The first bug of the season and Gabby's up there screaming and yelling and flapping her hands. And Stella's just rocking it, you guys. This is our horse. <laughs> G 
Gabby's freaking out because there's a bee. <laughs> Gabby! <laughs> Chill out. Just control your breathing and pretend you don't care about it. Dreams, you guys. Dreams. Total dreams. If you believe in love, give me a feeling. If you believe in me, hold me and let me in. If you are ready, I'm gonna reach you. I've got a feeling you're gonna reach me too. Stella doesn't like that. All right, here we go. The is actually very nice. Oh dear. Very good. <laughs> Leader. Can you believe that? And I feel like he loves me for calling you to my life. the way. We're around the world together. So the way. Come again. It's now or never. We're going away. We're back. We're gonna give these beautiful, amazing horses some lunch. Look what we came back to. I think this is it, you guys. I think it's time to put our top layer on. What do you guys think? Did she? Right. That is it for today. Hey guys, um, that's it for today's video. I wanted to say a big, huge thank you to L Hall, one of our subscribers, for your amazing comment on one of our recent videos. I love that you always leave positive, kind, amazing comments, and it is so appreciated. Um, so I dedicate this video to you. But that is it. We're going to end today's video, and we'll see you guys tomorrow for more horsey adventures. Bye. Bye. Don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.